Hi y'all, Jordan Schlacey here with Joan Co. Realty Group and today I wanted to candidly and unscriptedly <laughs> answer a question. This question is, why do I live in Texas? So let me kind of go ahead and get comfortable. I wish I had tea, but I did not brew tea. But we have water. I actually have chocolate, but I don't think I should be eating chocolate on camera. It's coffee chocolate, it's amazing. Okay, I'm gonna show it to you. Okay, one, sorry if you're a guy, but this lip gloss is amazing. It's not the right color for the shirt. I'm wearing this lip gloss right now, but this lip gloss is my favorite. But I want to show you this chocolate. This chocolate right here is the best chocolate in the whole entire world. This is Coffee Crunch. Um, Choco Love XOXO. Yeah. X. It's amazing. So coffee crunch and dark chocolate. Also the almond butter with dark chocolate around it is really good too. Okay. So now I'm comfortable. Um, why do I live in Houston? The number one reason why I live in Houston, well, one, I was born here and <laughs> my parents brought me here, but when I, I've moved away and I've come back quite a lot. And the number one reason why I live here is because of all the opportunities. There are so many opportunities for you here, no matter how old you are. So if you are in college or if you're college age, there are so many schools here for every single person. Like no matter what your interests are or, you know, how hard of a school you want to go to, there's so many private schools and public schools and they're all really like in the top rated. So I would say opportunities, whether it's school or jobs, that's like why I live here. So obviously I went to college, not obviously, but I went to college here and I wasn't always happy throughout college, but Lone Star, I went to a community college first and Lone Star, I went to two actually. And the first one I hated <laughs> and the second one was Lone Star and I loved it. I really fit in. I thought, I felt like it was a really good place to be transitioning from high school to college. So I graduated high school year early, so I was 17. And so that was kind of weird, you know, being thrown into well, one, I was living in Kansas, going to school, which is, you know, a town like this big. And then I moved to Houston, Texas, which is humongous. And I had never really driven before and I learned how to drive here. So probably, I don't know. I'm not the best driver in the world, but I know how to be really cautious. I just, it's, you have to have a little bit of aggression if you're gonna live in Texas, especially Houston. The highways are just insane. And the way other people drive is insane. Um, but I would say I'm answering why do I live in Texas? Uh, the opportunities, like if you are an entrepreneur, I feel like this is the best place in the world to live. Like if you don't have an online business anyways, I'm sure there's other places that are a lot better, like better on taxes and stuff like that. But I, I really do love it for the opportunities. So number one is the opportunities. Number two are the people. I love the people here. People are happy and friendly and just like so full of life and I don't know. I feel really at home here. <laughs> okay, so number three, I would say, what's the, what's the third reason why I love Texas? I love the weather. I do. I love how hot it is. I love how it's hot most of the year. I like that I can wear, I like that I'm not freezing. Although I probably have more sweaters than anyone else I know. Like I can't help it. They're so beautiful. And TJ Maxx and Marshalls has sweater, has sweaters so cheap. Okay, so it is, I don't know what today is. It's Friday and the month is June. So it's Friday, June 19th. It's right before Father's Day. And um, right now, if you, so it's COVID, right? And right now, if you need to go shopping and your city is open and you go to TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Home Goods, or Ross, or Burlington, you will know that there is nothing there. Like everything is overpicked. I tried to go to buy comforters for my little girls for their bedrooms. We moved a year ago and I still haven't bought them like new comforters yet. And they have like green crazy wallpaper. So my house was built in 1985. It's huge. I won't tell you how tell you how big it is because you're going to judge me but completely original 
and they have like the craziest green wallpaper. If I like to edit, I would be editing the editing in what their wallpaper looks right now, but I hate to edit. Um, crazy green wallpaper with like dark green and mint green and so they had patch quilted like comforters so i went looking for comforters and there was absolutely none nothing twin size that like tj maxx i actually went to two and i couldn't find any did i go to two no i think i just went to one and then i gave up and i ended up at target so target is the only place where you can buy anything these days they even have hand sanitizer again the grocery stores and uh, Target both have hand sanitizer, which is awesome. But we, I got online and I bought like two jugs of hand sanitizer, like liquid hand sanitizer, not gel, but like liquid. So like you can spray bottle it. I haven't opened them yet and I probably shouldn't be telling people I have these, but they were $50 each. So I actually technically, I have two. So I'm actually fine on hand sanitizer. We, what are we out of? Is there anything we couldn't find? Sheets. Um, I'm obsessed with sheets. Like we buy probably one a month, but they're only like $20, $30. Like I love sheets, brand new sheets. Ah, oh, it's like the most amazing thing in the world. I feel like I work really hard and I deserve <laughs> new sheets all the time. Um, I have totally gotten off track, but I couldn't find any comforters. But anyways, I went to Target and they had like three light pink twin comforters. And so now my girls have comforters. Um, so the number three reason was, oh, I'm so mad at myself. I'm not even gonna be able to upload this video now. So number one reason why I called Texas home was the opportunities. Number two was the people. And it's just the best place to live for an entrepreneur. <laughs> I don't know what I was saying. Oh goodness. So I have lived in Texas, Kansas, Florida, North Carolina, and Arizona. Those are all the different places I've lived. Oh, the weather. Number three was the weather. Um, I love the weather here. Oh, that's the joke. I had like a joke. So you can't find anything at TJ Maxx and Marshalls right now except sweaters. Like they have more sweaters than you'll ever need, ever, ever, ever. And they're all on clearance. I got like a $300 sweater for 40 or 30 bucks, like a $300 sweater. I didn't even know they made $300 sweaters, but for $30, it's so cute. I wore it to bed last night. That's how excited I was about my sweater, but I have tons of sweaters. I have a really nice sweater jacket wardrobe. So I would say those are probably my favorite months, but I, because I can wear boots, I love boots and jacket, boots and um, sweaters. That's probably my favorite and layering. I love layering. But Texas just has really, like, tons of people are going to warn you about the weather. I think they're crazy. Just for the record, I think they're crazy. The weather here is amazing. Like, I love the weather. Now, I have to wear pants most of the time, which is a pain in the rear end. And they stick to you because it's hot here, like crazy hot. But I don't care. Like, I bet it's, I wish I wasn't recording on my camera. I bet it's like 80 some degrees. <clears throat> I wonder if this will work. Hey, Siri. my iPad. Hey Siri. I want to ask Siri what's the temperature. What's the temperature outside? Weather for where? Houston, Te Texas. I was gonna say spring, Texas. It's about 81 degrees in Houston, 81 Texas. degrees. It is June. The middle, late part of June, it's 81 degrees in Texas, given it's 10 o'clock at night. Oh my gosh, it's 10 o'clock at night. My husband's gonna hurt me. He has scotch outside and he's waiting for me. But yeah, Texas is amazing. It might not be the most beautiful state ever, but there are tons of beautiful areas. And the culture here is amazing. There are tons of museums. There are tons of, there's so much theater. There's so much art. Like, it's an awesome place to live. I feel like I can hear my husband. Okay, so those are the top three reasons why I live in Texas. And I would say number four is, it's my, I can't imagine raising a family anywhere else. Like, how many times am I going to say like, but like legit, it's amazing here. And you should check it out. So if you are relocating to the Houston suburbs and you need a real estate agent and or a friend to help you navigate 
the suburbs, please give me a call. Uh, again, I'm Jordan Schlacey with Joan Kill Realty Group. Check out all my links below. There is a link to schedule a call with me. There is a link for a questionnaire. I have eBooks, I have um, YouTube videos, and I have my website with blog posts. And yeah, I felt like I was gonna tell you a little bit about myself. So I'm in my 30s. We have six kids. My husband and I are, it's like the his, mine, ours. His, mine, ours? What is it? <laughs> his. Yours, mine, ours? Yours, mine, ours. So, right? I can't remember. It's too late at night. I've been at my computer all day long. So I sat down at my computer to record videos. And of course, I didn't start until like 8.30 at night. So, but I have been sitting here all day. I've just been putting out fires. I can't help it. Um, but yeah, I love life and I love you. I hope you have a good night. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.